Sauri Krap. As we come to the end of another uninterrupted and jam-packed year at Rugby School Thailand, it is a time for reflection and self-evaluation. Has it been a good year? Well, that is dependent on what you measure that against. If the measure is precipitation, then the answer is most definitely no. We've had so little rain that all of the lakes around the school, including the West Lake, are so low and unusable for our water sports at the moment. It has been a terrible year for precipitation. If the measure, on the other hand, of our success is our student numbers, while still maintaining world-class student-to-teacher ratios, then the year has been a huge success, with the growth in the student population of 25% over the last two years. But, of course, neither of these is the actual measure that counts. So what actually are those important measures? There are hundreds of quotes attributed to Albert Einstein, many of which are misattributed and false. But this one is so powerful that it is irrelevant who actually said it. It speaks volumes about measuring the right things and setting the right success criteria, as I spoke about a couple of weeks ago, for every individual that we work with, not the whole. After all, the whole person, singular, is the whole point. I'm sure you've all heard the quotation before, but it says, everyone is a genius, but if you judge a fish by its ability to climb a tree, it will live its whole life believing that it is stupid. Our rating systems, our measures, are what matters if we're actually going to see how we are truly doing. There are three that I believe are true measures of our success. One is the community happy. I think on the whole, the school is a very happy place. And despite ups and downs, which is life really, most of our community are extremely happy to be here and to work together. Number two, are the students safe? I believe we do everything we can to keep all in our community safe and secure. Fundamental to this is the safeguarding and protecting the students in our care. That is our primary role. And finally, number three, are the students improving in all areas of their development? I hope the holistic answer to this is yes. And now, through our improved tracking systems for the students that we are embedding into the school, we are able to actually show and track these improvements, especially where academic improvement is concerned. Of course, we don't all improve at the same rate and in the same areas, but I do believe everyone in our care is improving, and that is very satisfying. I thank everyone in the community for all of their support over the year and wish you all a most enjoyable holiday. Kop Kunkrapp.